Are you ladies looking for a quick and simple way to look flawless? Well, let me show you. My all-time favorite foundation is the Lancome 24-Hour Makeup in 450 Suede. I just use a Real Techniques face brush that you can get from the drugstore. I squirt one or two pumps of the foundation onto my hand, I dab the brush into it, and then I apply it evenly all across my face, making sure to get in the creases of my eyes and all around my hairline and even a little bit under my chin to try and blend it really well. This foundation is a little bit too light for me now because I have gotten some sun since the beginning of the summer, but it's not that drastic, so I still use it anyways. Next I have my Lancome Concealer in Caramel, which I use to apply under my eyes just to cover up those dark circles and I only use a couple dabs, a little goes a long way. I put a dab on my chin and over my forehead in between my eyebrows and just a little streak down the bridge of my nose. I normally use just my middle finger and my ring finger to blend it all in. I make sure to get up right to the line of my eyelid and I just blend it all in and give myself a nice simple highlight. I also have my Mary Kay Concealer in Bronze 1. I just use a little dab to cover up any dark spots or acne scars that I have that my foundation didn't quite cover up all the way. A little does go a long way with this stuff too, so I just apply it sparingly to any spots that were not covered by my foundation. Next I have my Maybelline Expert Wear Velvet Black Pencil. I use this on my eyebrows. I found that this is the best eyebrow pencil I could ever find that doesn't get it too dark and makes it just look really natural. All that I do is draw a line underneath my eyebrow and then over top my eyebrow so I have my outline and then I just fill it in with small strokes very lightly until it's the desired darkness and shape that I want. When I just need to do my eyebrows really quick it works great and it's super simple because you can just draw on a perfect line if you want and fill it in nice and lightly without it being too dark. It does not work for me very well as an eyeliner. I only use it on my eyebrows. And there's both my eyebrows completed. Next, just to get a little bit of contouring in, I have my NYX Highlight and Contour Pro Palette and I use just a cheap little brush I got from Walmart. I apply it to just beneath my cheekbones to add a little warmth to my face because the foundation kind of washed me out a little bit. I go under my cheekbone and make a little C motion to work my way up towards my forehead. Then I swoop over my forehead to the other side, do another little C motion and swoop under my cheekbone on the opposite side. I do this just to add a little bit of warmth to my face just so I won't be as washed out from the foundation I put on. I also apply it to my jawbone on both sides as well. Next I use my CoverGirl Clean Glow Brusher in 100 Roses. I use that same brush that I used to contour and I dab it in there in the darkest color just to add a little bit of blush to my cheekbone above where I contoured. For eyeliner, I use CoverGirl Perfect Point Plus in Black Onyx, and I just apply this to my lid right above my eyelashes. I like to hold my eyelid taut as I apply this, uh, but since I was holding the mirror in my hand, I could not do that, so I struggled a little bit. 
but it still came out good. When I apply the eyeliner, I go from inner to outer lid and I don't usually go out too far. I just add a little bit of swoop just to give it some character, but nothing too drastic. And it's super easy with the pencil, so there's hardly ever any mistakes. Once I'm done with my upper lid, I apply it to my waterline as well, just going from inner to outer all the way across. To prevent any eyeliner that may accumulate in the corner of my eyelid, I just use my finger to wipe away the eyeliner that may have gotten there. For our mascara, I use my L'Oreal Paris Double Extend Beauty Tubes Mascara. This stuff is amazing and it comes off so easily when you wash it off at night just comes off in little tubes like it says. I use the white priming side first to prime my upper lashes and then I'll use the actual black mascara to go back over each side and get it as thick and dark as I like. So you guys may laugh at me for this one, but for my bottom lashes, I just use a tube of sample mascara that I had gotten from Lancome when I first bought my foundation like a year ago. So yeah, you guys probably don't have that, but you can just use um, whatever mascara you have as well for your bottom lashes. It works just as well. I just like it because it's a small brush. Finally, I use my flavored lip gloss that I got from Victoria's Secret in the color Cherry Bomb. I just lightly dab it onto my lips and rub it in, and that's it. Here's my finished look. I hope this was helpful for you guys, and I hope you find it as simple as I do.